you realize you're sitting in this movie theater, IMAX, 3D, Dolby, whatever, uh, <laughs> stereo sound. It, so it's, it's, you realize no matter what's playing, it's just tough. It's only stuff. So you get a chance to pull yourself back and you can use this imagery if you like that this is a 3D movie theater and any movie theater, you know, you look back there, there's a beam of light. There's a beam of light from which all this is being projected. If you start looking at the beam of light, firstly, that's a big aha. I was always paying attention to the images around me and now, wait, this beam of light, and you know it's always been there. It's not like you just, this is brand new, somebody turned it on. The fact that there's images proves that there is light. It's always been there. It's just that now we're like, oh, wait a minute. So far I was so caught up in whatever was the action-packed movie, I'm sure. Um, we start actually instantly there's a shift in our consciousness because there's a seeing like a, a, a more deeper clearer seeing that no matter what's playing out that's not it that's coming out of the light that when you actually see it is not just a nice idea when you actually see the light even while the movie's playing out and somebody's at the edge of a cliff and they're gonna, who knows what will happen, you can still get a tremendous sense of assurance from the light of a reality which is truer and deeper than what's, whatever is in the images. The images are always fluctuating and they're never the whole story. And this is closer to the real truth. So, in fact, simply shifting your attention, your awareness, your consciousness from the imagery to the beam of light, big change, big change. Try doing this in an actual physical movie theater and the next time you're there, right? You could play with this and, you know, there's the latest James Bond movie. You know, a lot of stuff going on, a lot of explosions, plane crashes, everything is going on. And if you just keep looking at the beam of light, you'll be surprised. You'll be very at peace. Even though it looks like oh, this, they're going to kill, they're going to kill James Bond any minute now. But it doesn't trouble you at all. It doesn't trouble you. And you don't have to read a book. Uh, you just feel it. And you are, it's not just self-talk, right? That's the key. This is not just a few beautiful thoughts, uh, like a little talk you can give yourself. Oh, it's all, all the light. You actually are seeing the light. It's like, and you know this light is the light. And because of this light, you're seeing James Bond leaping across buildings. Otherwise, he can't do anything <laughs> without the light. So you have a fundamental sense of it's all light it's the magic of light even though it may look good and bad depending on what's playing out it's all the magic of the light and you too are part of that magic and you can rest in that and that resting is a very deep sense of I don't need to sweat about anything. It's all good. It's all good. So you feel this very beautiful sense of going back to what I was saying earlier, a sense of inspiration. Then you're like, wow, I can't believe the light is able to create all this. Now notice the different kind of thoughts. You're appreciating all the stuff that's going on, no matter what, what imagery there is. It's more like, this is amazing, this is so cool, this is wonderful. It's inspired. Now you stepped into inspiration, you stepped into flow, you stepped into, by my mere presence, I want to be able to positively impact everything. 
And I am not concerned about the details, whether this image is going to do that, and that image is going to do this. That's not my business. It's to radiate light, radiate goodwill, radiate love, and that is going to take care of everything. So that's something we can step into anytime, anywhere. And, and of course, all this is an internal process, right? You may be sitting in a boardroom, a meeting room. You don't have to turn off all the lights and go into meditation, right? This is real time, anytime. You don't have to say a word. You don't have to share anything with anyone talking about what's going on inside you. This is a purely internal process. Other people are watching the movie, enjoying it, let them enjoy it. Don't tap, <laughs> start tapping people around you and say, hey look, that's where the light is coming from. Did you know this light? Let them enjoy the movie, <laughs> no problem. When you choose light, life becomes increasingly joyful, purposeful and inspired. I invite you to join me to explore the realms of light, the infinite possibilities that light offers.